Companies handle their staff members' leave time differently, depending on the legal environment where they operate, their workplace culture, and corporate values. But in general, leave benefits across businesses are a combination of paid and unpaid time off. In this video, we will discuss what unpaid time off is and how to create an efficient time off policy. Both types of employee leave can be taken to indulge in a short break from work, recover from a disease, and so on. The main difference between the two is that unpaid time off is not compensated by an employer. Most of the companies don't let their staff members make use of unpaid time off freely and prefer to apply specific rules on how and when a person can request unpaid time off. In the United States, employers are generally left to decide whether to offer paid or unpaid time off to their employees since there are no federal laws mandating to give any sort of vacation time to workers. However, under the Family and Medical Leave Act, companies with over 50 staff members are required to provide up to 12 weeks of unpaid leave time a year in some cases. If you want to offer an unpaid leave package to your team members, you need to develop a policy that outlines all the rules and procedures you plan to apply. This document will protect your company from productivity drops, as well as the immense costs of uncontrolled employee absenteeism and time off abuse. Leave management in ACTA plans allows you to create an unlimited number of leave types, request and plan time off, and review employee availability. Besides, you can run insightful reports to keep track of employee absences, plan resources, and stay compliant with time off policies. Explore our complete guide to unpaid time off and learn how to streamline your leave management process. Discover valuable insights on managing unpaid time off effectively.